What happened, did they say? Matthew Harrison Brady died of a bust of belly. You know what I thought of him, and I know what you thought. Why should we weep for him? Let us read the lamentations to the illiterate. Matthew Harrison Brady wept enough for himself. The National Theater the National of Weeping Water, Nebraska, who flooded this nation like a one man Mississippi. You know what he was? A Bible eating Barnum busted, whatever, sorry. <laughs> a Barnum? A Barnum, a Barnum Funkin' Bible beating bastard. You ass. <laughs> that was a good one, actually. You ass. You have no more right to spit on his religion than you have the right to spit on my religion or my lack of it. Well, what do you know? Henry Drummond even in defense of his enemies. There was much greatness in that man. Shall I put that in on obituary? You can write any damn thing you like. How do you write an obituary for a man who's been dead for 30 years? In memoriam MHB. Let's say what? Hail, the apostle whose letters to the Corinthians were lost in the mail. Two years, ten years, the tourists are going to ask the guy, who died here? Matthew Harrison, who? So you're gonna make it it fits. What did he say to the minister? He wrote his own obituary. Here's Bible. This is it, isn't it? His book, Proverbs, isn't it? He who troubleth his own house shall inherit the wind. Oh. And the fool shall be servant to the wise in heart. We're growing an odd crop of agnostics this year. You know, I'm getting damn tired of you, Hornbeck. Why? Because you never push the nail up against the verb except to blow something up. Ah, that's a typical lawyer's trick, accusing the accuser. Well, what am I accused of? I charge you with contempt of conscience, self-perjury, kindness of forethought and sentiment, sentimentality in the first degree. Why? Because I want to erase a man's life? I tell you Brady had the same rights as Kate's. The right to be wrong. Oh, be kind to Bigot Sweet. Since Brady's gone, how we must be kind. Oh, God, how this world is rotten with kindness. A great man once lived in that body. But Matt Brady lost his way. You went looking for God too high up and too far away. You hypocrite. You fraud. You are more religious than he was. Excuse me, gentlemen. I must find my typewriter and hammer out a story about an atheist that believes in God. Colonel Drummond? Ah, oh, Bert. I'm resigning my commission in the state militia. I'm handing in my sword. Doesn't it cost a lot of money for an appeal? I, I couldn't pay you. Ah, uh, well, I didn't come here to be paid. Anyway, I have to get myself on a train. There's one note at 513. Bert, you and I could be on that train. I'll get my stuff. I'll help you. <laughs> Don't have to shake your hand. No. We're not doing that. No, you just no. call in over your shoulder. You just call in over She dragged you <coughs> out. See you at the depot. Oh wait, you, you forgot, you forgot your darn one. Okay. <laughs> 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 <laughs>